is a presentation from Dr. Wrestling Midnight Guthrie and Impact Pro Wrestling. And this is a no disqualification, anything goes match for the IPW Tag Team Championship. All right, Dr. Wrestling Midnight Guthrie on the call here for what should be just a real skull cracker. As the Cowboys from Hell are challenging the champions, the hooligans, in a no DQ environment. Certainly the hooligans know main, but the Cowboys from Hell are tremendous brawlers, tough guys in their own right. This should be an experience if there ever was one. Here we go, the hooligans coming to town with the belts coming to fight. Last month, these teams ended a uh, disqualification situation as the Cowboys from Hell let weapons get involved. The hooligans put down the challenge tonight. Jason Michaels joining me on commentary, who now, as a result of that scramble pull match earlier tonight, has a real vested interest in this one. As we saw the shocking move, you kicked Fouts to the curb, and Smooth and Fearing are now going to vie for the Tag Team Championships. That's their goal in the future, is that correct? It's not just the goal, it's what we are going to do. Next month, Cowboys And here we go, the fight is on! Cowboys from Hell, Hooligans, no matter who it is, we're ready for them. Throwing down with Mason Democrat. Oh, the Ozarkian Kung Fu already coming out. Nice chops there. Von Baron really getting the best of uh, Mason with the right hand. Never mind. Back to the chopper for Von Baron. Big right. What a right hand. Man alive. That's one thing about Mason Cutter's game is uh, coming off that leg injury about this time last year. He's really up, ramped up the efforts as hand-to-hand -hand striking. But... Jason Michaels, I was shocked. Ray Fearing could have chosen a singles title opportunity instead, working team-based and immediately getting AJ Smooth a title opportunity upon joining the stud club. You know, they tried to make us earn this damn thing again. We won the number one contendership for the tag titles here a couple months ago. And then they're like, oh, hey, you know what? You gotta do it all over again in this uh, number one contender. Oh, match. what a chop by DC. So why would we give up a tag title match opportunity that we already earned? This just solidifies this. And now with AJ Smooth and Ray Fearing as the most dominant tag team, and by the way, with AJ Smooth, we are most definitely the most dominant tag team right now. In he is a former tag team champion. And a former heavyweight champion. And in this situation, I know I, uh, both of your opponents will be tough, but uh, I think your team would have no problem going toe-to-toe -to -toe with either of these teams. We want the Cowboys from hell. We don't want the hooligans. hooligans we don't want the hooligans. Are, hooligans are smelly. Oh, come on. Undeserving. Big Uranagi slam. And they're undeserving oh, attack champions. He nailed Von Maren so hard he might speak perfect English after that one. He knocked the stutter out of him. Have you mentioned uh, when the Cowboys from hell really put the boots to the hooligans last month. Well, that way, I mean, there was weapons involved and that was unnecessary, but that lit a fire under uh, Devin and Mason, that's for sure. Oh, come on, just say it as it is. Really, the Cowboys from Hell should be the uncrowned tag team champions. Really? I don't know about that. Oh, come on. They won last month. Let's face it. Oh, and the chair's getting introduced here. Our core now, this is one thing. Look at this. They're using... Wow! Body slams assisted with the chairs. 
Yeah, you want to talk about innovation with weapons. The hooligans have brawled coast to coast. They've brawled down in Mexico and Canada. Uh, I saw these men in a uh, in Florida for FIP in a match where they literally brawled out of the bar into the street. Cars were having to stop in the road, not even knowing there was wrestling happening that night because men were fighting in the street. It was incredible. The hooligans should pray to the heavens that the Cowboys from hell beat them. Big tonight. shot there. They really should because if the Cowboys from hell don't beat them, we will. Yes. Is he biting them? Yeah. He's, yeah. Look at Mason Cutter. How, just come on. How can you cheer? Anything for goes. Team? How can you cheer for a team like that? Well, these guys, uh, I mean, and they have some technical savvy, but they didn't get to the ranks there he got through technical wrestling, that's for sure. Now, what the hell are they doing? Now uh, there's the another hell? table over there from our tables match earlier. And they are, uh, they are calling for that table. The Cowboys from Hell are staggering on the inside. Now we uh, saw Justin Decent in a promo yesterday on Facebook, uh, looking a lot like Skinner, but he uh, conveyed his uh, history in the military, how he'd been to war before. And look at this, they're getting the upper hand now, as the hooligans maybe took too much time appealing to the crowd getting that table there. That's the kind of people they are. We, and you know what? People like the Cowboys from Hell, they don't take that kind of crap. They don't care about that fanfare. They don't give a damn. They what certainly do don't. Bad man, right to the rib cage. Rightfully so. Break his leg again. Come on. Why not? Put them through as much pain as possible, gentlemen. Well, Devin Cutters has some rib issues, but it's his brother Mason who had the broken leg. Well, break both their legs. I don't and care. And look at this move. Oh, drop kicks the chair. The only saving great. Oh, never mind. The only saving great. I thought it was glancing below the head, but he nailed the arm very hard there. And look at that kick out there. But you know what? You mentioned uh, one of the hooligans having a leg injury and coming back after breaking Mason, yep. We'll talk about Aaron Von Baron. He had a leg injury. He had Absolutely. a broken leg here a few years ago. And what kind of a career? When he's very much got a bionic leg at this point. Oh, got a lot of metal in there. Oh, man, alive. We'll talk about the career he's had since going back from there. People thought he was done. People thought that he was done in his 20s, would never be able to wrestle again. They counted him out and look at what he's done. I give him all the credit. He's a very, very tough competitor, very underrated competitor. Yes. Now, Justin Easton chiding the referee, saying there's no rules, but it's still up to the referee to try to enforce whatever possible rules he maybe can. There's no rules. So there's, there's you the got to look out for the welfare work. of the athletes, that's, Yeah, that's still. it. That's the only thing he can look out for. Is, okay, so one rule. Don't kill your opponent, please. Is that the rule? Is that the rule? Well, that, that is. Adam I Kennedy? mean, just a, in, in overall society, that's a rule, yeah. Well, it's a wrestling match. They sign a waiver, I'm sure, so... Hardcore warfare, what do you do? <laughs> I don't think you get off a murder rap for killing a dude if it's in the confines of the wrestling He signed a waiver. The hooligans are dumb enough. They don't and look at now, a submission man. hold here. The ropes aren't going to help you at all. Oh, man, a lie. <laughs> Did you hear that? I can hear that over at Principal Park. Or Sec Taylor Stadium if you're a traditionalist. I'm surprised you know baseball. I really am. I know uh, landmarks in Des Moines. You don't know baseball. I'm disappointed in you. I was a soccer guy. Not baseball. It's not baseball. No. But you know what? They're going to use this uh, chair and maybe uh, give a little fastball here. Uh, wait a minute here. Uh oh, maybe something else. What do we got? Devin's in a bad way here. And oh Decent my God. cinches him up into. Oh, a back suplex on the chair. You get him on the chair there? Right on the neck. Right on the neck, Guthrie. There's such a crowd here, it's hard to see some of this action tonight. Capacity crowd once again here at the Forte Center. They keep growing and growing these crowds for Impact Pro Wrestling. And it's only gonna get better this year, 2018. I mean, it says something for your wrestling event when there's a lot of other professional wrestlers in the crowd just here to watch your event. You know what I love is uh, IPW actually voted the promotion of the year from Pro Absolutely, and on the outside of the ring, Mason hits the ring post hard. And it's Von Baron. It's going oh to work. He's going to break the toes. Dees is going to break the oh! toes. Oh! Man, alive. That's the danger of not wearing boots in the ring. And the hooligans, known for their uh, barefoot combat for many I years. Like it. I like it. Fair game. There you go. There you go. I mean, they spend a lot of time outdoors, a lot of time in uh, campers and tent situations. They're used to barefoot living. But nothing prepares you for having your toes snapped by a 265 pound man. 
Cowboys from hell. Cowboys from hell. Now remember, they've held the tag titles in the past. They are desperate to get them once again. They have a new sinister edge about them. And then, you know, we respect that. The stuff club respects that. I respect that. You should respect that. I don't oh, straight in the combat boots on the I eyes. I don't think you respect them enough, Guthrie. I respect them a tremendous amount. No, no, no. I, just, I don't like their approach. And, this match I mean, they're just despicable human beings. Oh, we've general. got a sharpshooter applied. Mason, excuse me, Devin is screaming in pain. Mason trying to call her back into the ring, stopped by Decent. This could be, oh, come on. Decent going to work on Mason. He's got those combat boots. He's not even wearing traditional wrestling boots tonight. Those are actual combat boots issued by the military. As Devin Cutter, has he, did he give up? Did he tap? No? He is not yet. How, this could break his leg. Well, Von Baron lets go, though. Why did he let go? More pain. Well, they have something else in mind, but that might prove to be a, a real mistake. Look at all! Oh, look at this! Yes, they're gonna break his leg. Oh, he, Justin Decent's De asking Von Baron to do that trademark German suplex. Let's just break him in half. Let's just break him in half. Yes, he's got him cinched up for the German suplex. Oh, could be the clothesline German. Come on! They nailed him! What a move there! Picture perfect. Oh man! Now that, what a save by Mason Cutter. I don't think that was a save. That was three and a half. The animal with the clothesline German suplex. They call that a trip to destruction. Big right hands. And Mason is a house of fire. Big chop there. The hooligans certainly know how to fire up. There we go. Chops galore. Yes, chops and punches. There you go. Oh, no. Oh. Could, could be the hooligan rush. Oh, what a knee to the face. Oh, Cal, he nailed all that one. He crossed the chest and the entirety of the face. Almost 300 pounds. Of, oh, decent kicks out. He is a former heavyweight champion. He is as tough as they come, folks. He held the heavyweight title for almost a full year. Come on now, Decent. Come on, AVP, get in this. Have. Oh no. Oh no, 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 no. We got a table in the ring now. Oh my god, this is, that is an old table, folks. That is, uh, wow. You know, a, couple, a few of the tables here in this building are from the old Hotel uh, Fort Des Moines. <laughs> and they made tables a lot more durable in the past, let me tell you. You are such a history buff, aren't you? Well, Des Moines has such a rich history of professional wrestling. Tables with little animals on them is history in wrestling. Little animals? Who said anything about animals? Got a bunch of animals in the ring right now fighting it out. And... Yep. Oh my, yeah, the traditional human approach to dealing with problems has gone around. Oh, Stuttgart Cutter! Stuttgart Cutter, and he saved the day for Decent there. Oh, he hits a blow! Oh, and a big right hand there by Decent. Great teamwork by the Cowboys from now. Yeah, these guys have been in some real crazy ones. Remember that cage match this last summer in Knoxville? Many of these bouts we're talking about, you can check out on the YouTube channel. YouTube.com slash Midnight Guthrie. Wait a second, hey, hey, And Guthrie. we might have a viral video clip in the making here, folks. As Mason Cutter with the save, oh, what a move! What a move, the toughness of Mason Cutter is incredible. One of the toughest men in the United States. Wait and a second, we no, have no, no, now no, Decent, no. Now, now what's going on here? Decent is planted with a number of right hands. You know how many bar fights these guys have been in? What Last the time they were kicked out of a bar, oh God, it was four o'clock on Guthrie, a Tuesday. Guthrie! Oh, wait a minute here. Oh my God, he's got a, he's got a tower to his own. Oh my, oh, God. My oh, my God. God. oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Oh my God! Baron hits oh hard. Oh Decent oh just God. got a massive leg drop from oh its own God. partner. Von Baron, someone better check that young man out. Oh wow! Incredible! The cannonball couldn't get the job done. 
Now, wait a minute. They should just pit them right here, though. Those selfish They've done enough bastards. damage. Those selfish They're bastards. trying to break it here. Those selfish bastards. Oh, what a... Gonna cover him on the table. He got him. I have never seen a man covered on top of a table before in my life. What an victory for the hooligans. Bob Jamania gonna run wild for a while now. Nothing about that felt much for Justin Decent, I can tell you that much. Someone needs to check Von Barron's neck. Cause he just got, he literally essentially took a brain buster from the top. Tandem beat brain buster. I don't, I don't leg dropped his own partner in the process. I don't think Garrett's okay. We need to get him checked out. Man alive! That was some, one of the wilder finishes to a match I've ever seen. Hooligan still attacked him. You sure you want to go up against that, Michaels? You're damn right. Presentation from Dr. Wrestling Midnight Guthrie and Impact Pro Wrestling. Visit ImpactProWrestling.com for more information about upcoming events.